Jane Cervella. I'm the Director for Ambulatory Services at UH Geneva Medical Center and Conneaut Medical Center. And I am Ashley Fertig, uh, Manager of the Emergency Room and ICU at Conneaut and the Emergency Room and the Urgent Care for Geneva. How long has urgent care in this plaza been in the works? Probably the last five, six months. Six months. Is this what you would call a soft opening? This is actually our opening day today. We, we had planned um, to open this fall and then we decided we needed to do a little construction. So we wanted to get it open so it would be available if anybody needed the services. And then we'll have a, a bigger opening with um, some marketing later on in the, in the year. Uh, so will that be after the first of the year, yes. you think? Okay. What does urgent care offer? Um, urgent care offers all sorts of things for um, simple procedures, um, lacerations, x-rays, sprain your ankle, um, can't get into your doctor for a couple days, you have a cold, congestion, anything like that. What would you uh, classify as the severity of injuries or illness that you can handle before they should go to the emergency room instead? These are minor injuries, minor illnesses, things that you probably would see your family physician for, or um, um, things that are non-emergent. It wouldn't be for chest pain, it wouldn't be for um, stroke, those type of things, but it, you know, for bruises, um, cuts, earaches. Um, Lacerations. Oh, okay. can you, like say, stitches and that? Can you stitches, do that? correct. Yes. All right, that's what I was. Broken bones? Correct. Mm -hmm. okay. We do all sorts of splinting, have all of that equipment here. Nothing too major then? Or? No, correct. Anything like chest pain or anything like that, we want you to go to the emergency rooms for those. Well, we're open 9 to 9, um, so again, if you can't get into your doctor, um, it's, there's no appointments necessary. You can just come um, at any time convenient for you. Um, it's a smaller copay than it would be to go to an emergency room as well. Now, is there always a doctor on duty? Um, there's physician assistants here okay. that are running it, mm -hmm. um, and then they are in communication with our Geneva emergency room as well. Are you open seven days a week? Correct. What is the staff size here? Um, we have one PA, um, and then we have one medic that's here the entire time as well. Um, we also have registration staff, um, radiology staff, and lab staff. What are you looking forward to uh, doing here? Um, just the services in general, I, you know, there's a lot of people that come to the ER that says, you know, I really don't need to see the emergency room physician, I have something simple, um, is there anywhere to go, and right now there wasn't, so now this is a nice service that we can offer for our community. The one thing I'd like to add is, is it's very conveniently located because um, not only can you come to the urgent care, but if you need lab, you need radiology, those services are here and you don't have to go elsewhere for that. So you expect this to be fully running after the first year then? Yeah, I would expect that we would start to see um, quite a bit of foot traffic in here. We do have a busy pediatrician office in here as well as um, a um, primary care office, audiology, so there is a lot of traffic in here and uh, they're not aware, the patients aren't aware yet that we've opened. I think one thing that's really important is that this is uh, a benefit to the community because there is no urgent care in the county and patients have to travel as far as um, Chardon, a Concord area, in order to go to an urgent care if that's what their insurance requires. So for them, it will be a benefit. It's right here. And for the employees of Geneva and Kania, it's directly in between the two locations. So that's a plus for us as well. Now I'm ready for the tour. Okay. <laughs> Basically, we had to um, set up just uh, the exam rooms okay. and the separate entrance. We had to trench the floors to run some electrical and to hook up the actual packs. They need an x-ray or a lab. Anybody can walk in with their order. Things to rule out, stroke. Um, somebody gets a head injury, you want to look to see if there's a bleed. We welcome the community to um, come and try our services. I, I think they'll find it very convenient and um, we hope that it's a, a true benefit to the city and to the county. 
I'm looking forward to servicing the county um, and providing simple needs, minor, minor injuries um, that they can't get anywhere else.